and Ollie Cam for today. So I hope you guys enjoy him. He's my little baby boy, so. <laughs> um, he woke me up at six this morning for cuddles, so that's kind of how my day started, but I'm not mad. <laughs> I'm never mad about that. Um, but yeah, if you guys want a quick tour of what we did yesterday, we plotted out once and for all, hopefully, the uh, the stone area around the four player houses we're going to be having, including mine. Uh, we moved my house like three times, I'm pretty sure at this point. Um, we're going to be putting in the other villagers today. If you guys don't know, if you guys haven't seen, I will show you. There is a trailer, actually a series of trailers, that were released in North America, I believe, for the original Animal Crossing GameCube here. And there are four characters in that, and we're going to be taking three of them and using them in this town as like a reference, because the trailers are so cursed. <laughs> but I will show you guys them in just a little bit here. It's been 13 years since I left school. Oh no, isn't that weird to think about? Which town is this? This is Lily Bells. This is actually the town that we started day one on stream all together. Uh, it just, it looks a little bit different. But Sting, how are you doing today? I think I have a solution. We just named the male character Jeff Rob. Oh, that could work. That could work. Just mash them up. Um, ooh, hello. Picked up a lost item. Should probably try to reunite with its owner. You know what I didn't do yesterday? <laughs> I didn't give the item to Ed. <laughs> I probably should do that. Um, awesome, Andrew. I'll check it when I'm on break. Uh, we also pretty much finished up the train station area here. We planted trees. We planted some flowers. Um, I'm really, really happy with how this ended up looking. We also kind of tried to do the whole archway thing. It's not working. I know it's not working, but we're trying. <laughs> Except from the hurricane. Oh, I hope your doggo is going to be okay. I know that that's definitely scary for everyone involved, little lone pupper, so definitely hope everything's going to be okay. Um, yeah, this is, this is like a big thing we did yesterday. I really enjoyed it. Uh, we also went through and tried to make our river a little bit more natural looking. I'm still going to work on it. I'm probably going to be working on that for like the rest of this, um, uh, I guess, season of Lily Bell, we could call it. Uh, we have a bridge down, I hope once and for all. I think I've moved that bridge like twice now. Uh, the waterfall semi-sorted. I really don't like this section here. Hey, Courtney, how's it going? Uh, let's see, we have our little lily pad and our dock area that we did that yesterday as well. Put down some more of the dirt, dirt swirls or whatever you want to call them. And this is Boots. He's in place. He's in place yesterday, I think, though. And Agnes is also now in place, which is nice. Oh, uh, let's see. What else did we do, chat? What else did we do? Hey, Ryan, how are you doing? I hope things have been good on your end. Welcome on in. Uh, I'll go show you Tom Nooks, I guess. It was kind of already done, but... Wedding is in 33 days. Oh my goodness, I really hope it goes well. That must be exciting, and I'm assuming nerve-wracking as well. Uh, we put down the tile in front of Nook's cranny. Our dump is looking pretty good, if I do say so myself. <laughs> and let's go actually down here. I'm gonna get the Pepsi Man morph suit for it. Um... The other thing we did just yesterday, right at the very end of stream, was we actually moved our museum. And ignore this, Maddie will eventually be moving. This is not permanent. Um, but we moved our museum. We also have the probably finished town tree area with Tortimer. Um, and I'm really quite happy with it. It's mental health issues, but mostly good. I'm sorry about that. I know how, uh, how stressful that can be for sure. I just realized I don't think this is going to be able to come out all the way. We might need to fix that. <laughs> hey, 
again, Tortimer. <laughs> Playing Animal Crossing GameCube the last two days, and I'm really enjoying it. I never had a GameCube as a kid. I was mainly a PC player, but seeing you play it made me want to give it a try. Oh my goodness. Do you know how much it means to me to hear people like going back and trying that game because of me? It is, hands down, still one of my favorite games of all time, let alone like one of my favorite Animal Crossing games. And it just, it makes me happy. <laughs> Uh, we have our little Tortimer, or Tortimer, oh my goodness, Captain sign, or our dock over this way. Um, I'm planning on, like, figuring out if I can add something to this to make it really look like this is where he'd be. Maybe the cucumber thing, because I think Kappas generally like cucumbers, right? At least I know from Harvest Moon they do. <laughs> Alright, no worries, Dream Pause. Enjoy the Sims. Have fun. Uh, we are going to be get rid of get ridding oh my god man today is a day i'm so sorry if i'm just like everywhere um getting rid of the random uh bridges <laughs> from our old layout here today as well uh let's see sahara's here today uh the able sisters is down here where they should be i'm really happy with how this area is turning out and that's the main thing we've done, honestly. Um, we do have this little area over here, which is kind of trying to be our mini island from the GameCube version. Um, we're going to move the tent eventually, and we're going to have Plucky in here when we find her. So that's kind of what this is. Getting rid of the random bridges. <laughs> Uh, this was the layout for the police station, which I still don't know how we're going to do that. And then this it would be the layout for the tent uh, eventually, I think. And yeah, that's pretty much what we got so far. That's kind of the layout we're working with. It's a bit of a mess, but we're getting there. Um, I think the most interesting thing about this build is other than the main sections of town, I can pretty much do whatever I want. In the other areas, in terms of trees or decorations, because obviously the original game doesn't really have outdoor decoration. Ollie, are you looking at the Pokemon poster? Or the Animal Crossing poster, because there's two there. Buddy, what are you doing? Ollie. You all good, buddy? He's like, okay, I'll stop now that you turned the camera on me. <laughs> what are you doing, Mr. Man? He's gonna take a bite of it. He may have seen it, like, blowing slightly because I have the AC on. Envy, hello! How's it going? I've been doing really good. I've been doing pretty darn good. Missed the GameCube version. You can play the old NES games now. I understand why they never kept that feature post-Wii, but still. Honestly, it was a really cool feature. I agree completely. It was really nice. Um, so I think what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna start off talking to my villagers, finding out who this lost item is for. Um, mainly because I haven't really been talking with them while we've been working, and I kind of want to change that. Does he want to be the best? <laughs> like, no one ever was. I mean, he wants to be the best something. I don't know if it's the best boy, because he's kind of a little evil thing, but that's all right. We like him anyway. Okay, will you take this item today? Ollie Rath. <laughs> uh, oh no, he's not gonna ask about it. Uh oh. We had this for him, <laughs> but it was from yesterday. Oh dear. Uh, why can't I show him the lost item? Uh, guys? I picked up a lost item, and I come in here and the dialogue was lost something, and he's like, okay, let me see. And now the game's like, what lost item? There is no lost item in your inventory. Ed does not wish to perceive. I'm really confused by that. I don't think I've seen that happen before. Let me try a different villager. Maybe it's because I should be handing him something. And I didn't. I picked up the lost item just today, like, like five minutes ago. Um, I'm gonna go try with Rod. 
Because that's really weird. It might just be because I have two things I'm supposed to be handing him and the game's a little bit confused. Okay, let's try with you. See? This one works. At Bob's house, though. Okay. So this is Bob's. That's still really weird. Um, but I guess this thing... What do I do with this? Oh, I don't want to open it. I feel bad that I forgot to hand that over. Uh, discovered a bug. <laughs> Look at us go. What are we, like, 20 minutes into stream and I've already broken my game. Gaston is there. Ed does not see. Am I getting stuck on some- oh, okay. Yeah, I think it's the present that was causing that issue, but... Um, uh, we saw Bob just a second ago. I noticed him next to Gaston. And now I don't know where he's gone off to. Okay, well, that's a bush. The moment when you feel yourself run into something behind a house, so you have to check if it's a villager or an item. Bob? Hello? Okay, okay, yeah. You're not Bob. Uh... See, he couldn't have gotten too far because I don't think they can climb up to the next layer if I don't have any stairs going up there. I could be wrong, but I don't think they actually can. Ah, uh, Courtney, I hope you had a fun stream. How was Stardew? We've lost our pop, you guys. Finally came up with an outfit idea for my character and now my story. Oh, it's 11 pages. Look at you go. That's awesome. Okay. Oh, there he is. Oh, are you doing a think again? You were doing a think yesterday, too. What's up? Can't find my bag with all my favorite snacks in it. He was here and now he's gone. Please help me find him. I do can't be expected to go all day without snacks. Okay. Am I being silly? <laughs> Megan. <laughs> Am I being silly or did villagers always have dialogue for when they lost something? Is this new? Or have I just not seen this before? I love how ACNH has taught us to fear what our villagers dare to think. <laughs> Little Contessa going. Really? You're my hero. Hey, bag, can you hear me? Stay calm, man. Burrito is on the way. I found it already, though. I'm so sleepy. Anyway, what's going on with you? Whoa. There you go. Uh. Random outfits on Google is definitely help for sure. For sure. I don't know why Automod caught that, but apparently it did. Pajama dress. <laughs> Actually, you know what? I probably should go get changed here, so... I just realized I'm wearing the same thing I was wearing yesterday. <laughs> Random. Yeah, you guys, I'm sorry. If you ever see a funny word get caught up, just assume it's, um... It's auto mod just being silly. We do have it on right now. It's not perfect, but it does help out quite a bit. So. Okay, so. Put this away. And I'll put these back too while we're here. No, actually, not keep that on me. Don't question any block words, try to get around it. Yeah, if there's a reason something's blocked, it's probably blocked. Unless you see auto mod being funny, then. Restart my island. I'm debating on whether or not I should pick up all my weeds. Ooh, or just some. I usually pick all of mine up. Um, okay, wait. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm going to derail my own stream. Guys, 
Can we please appreciate the cross paws? Look at how handsome my boy is. <laughs> Look at my baby boy. Um, he is such a good boy. Anyway, sorry. Um, I usually pick up all my weeds personally, and then if I decide I want to have a more natural looking town, I can always just put them back down or wait for them to regrow. But that's just me. He likes to do that. He likes to sit with his, his paws crossed. <laughs> I'm glad I finally caught him doing it. What are you looking at, buddy? Okay, no more cross paws. He's a big cat. No, he's massive, yeah. If I'm- I've, I've mentioned this before, but if I'm sitting down on the bed, for example, um, and he comes to sit next to me, he, and he's sitting up straight, and I'm sitting up straight, he comes up right to my shoulder. So a full, like, human torso. I mean, I'm smaller, but like, still. <laughs> he is a big boy. I've aided Automod before, but that's because the filter is dumb when it comes to any words starting with a certain four letters, like the opposite of digital. Yes, yes, that is fair. <laughs> he probably knows that too. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. What was I in here for? Was I in here for something? I think I was going to get changed, wasn't I? Um, okay, what should we wear today? It's raining, so maybe like a little raincoat sort of situation. I wish we had uh, coats with hoods. I think there is a hooded thing in this game, but I think it's like considered like a full headpiece. Uh, is it Tiger? Let me know. Welcome on in. How's it going? I want to make sure I'm not saying your name wrong. Um, so there's a little coat like that, maybe. Although this is maybe a proper raincoat. There we go. And we'll get some jeans on. There we go. Tiger, if you want, awesome. Welcome on in. How are you doing? Um, last night, though, you guys, speaking of rain, we had this massive thunderstorm and there was like proper forked lightning and everything. It was really, really nice. I'm glad we didn't lose power. Um, but I'm, I'm the type to enjoy thunderstorms, so that was pretty neat. Oh, um, should we wear a hat? Should we just do something like this, maybe? Hey, Atari Jinx, how's it going today? And let's do, let's find some rain boots. We're just gonna go all black today kind of feeling it. Thank you so much for the follow, by the way. Welcome on in. I hope your day's going well. If you guys are just joining us, uh, you guys have an Ollie cam today. He is my two-year-old baby boy um, and little gremlin on the side. <laughs> and we are working on an Animal Crossing GameCube themed town in ACNH. Uh, we have had this town since March 20th, so since release day uh, 2020. And uh, we've done a couple different themes for it, but this is our newest one, so it's really kind of a mess at the moment. And, um... What was I about to say? Uh, we're, we're theming it off of our Animal Crossing GameCube town that we're actually streaming as well, so... Yeah, welcome on in. Um, plans for today, though. As I mentioned, we need to go watch a trailer or two. If you guys have never seen these before, you're welcome. <laughs> or maybe I'm sorry, I don't know which to say. Uh, Animal Crossing on the GameCube had these really, really weird trailers uh, in North America that use these costume characters. And they're a little bit cursed, but they're very funny. And that's the characters we're going to be creating for this town here. Uh, I'm eventually going to delete them for our next theme. I don't usually like to have multiple characters, so it's going to be a bit weird for me. I don't think I've ever actually made a secondary character in New Horizons, so... Isn't it weird, Brandon? Alright, let me go ahead and find the trailer here really quick, and I'll get you guys set up so we can all watch it together. If you guys have never seen this before, it should be fun. <laughs> and some of you have, because I did show it off, like, I think a week or two ago. Hey, Rachel, how are you doing today? Okay, um, 
Um, so what we're gonna do here is give me just a brief second to get this set up for you guys. across the town do you have at the moment two costume characters that sounds terrifying it is <laughs> it is uh oh god what was i using for this is it display capture oh that may have been it give me just a second here there we go there we go all right give me a brief second i'm just gonna crop out the stuff we don't need here uh, now, bear in mind, this is from, like, I'm assuming, like, 2000, 2001, so... Good. Older trailer. <laughs> um, and obviously I'm not gonna get this full screen or anything, but... Something like that should work just fine for our purposes. So... Do, 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 do. Let me go ahead and make sure that that is on. Turn that down for myself. Turn this up. And we're going to go ahead and mute that. So you guys are going to have to let me know. Hopefully you're going to be able to hear it. A real-time game that's happening every second of every day? It's Animal Crossing for the Nintendo GameCube. Get your own place and become part of a thriving community. Meet your neighbors, chat with them, or help them by running errands. They'll reward you with cash, food, or even things to decorate your new home. Furnish your home any way you want, or pay off your loan and buy a better one. Choose different activities Do you guys have an echo? Day. Okay, I have no idea where the echo's coming from. <laughs> Um, I have zero idea where it's coming through. You guys are just going to have to deal with it. I'm so sorry. God, I get so confused about audio. Really not bad at all. Okay. Thanks. Catch insects, go fishing, or dig up fossils. As the seasons change, so will your activities. Up to four players can join the fun, trade with them, or arrange scavenger hunts. For a change of pace, hop a train to visit another village. Find new items and tasty fruit. There's always plenty to do, and something is always happening in Animal Crossing. We'll see you there. Here is a true story. Of four friends picked to live in a video game. And find out what happens when they stop being themselves. And start being someone else. Animal, Animal Crossing, Crossing for Nintendo, Nintendo GameCube. A walrus moved into the village today. Hot. i just been fishing, you know, seeing some pals. All Rob does is fish. Fish and see his pals. I'm the one getting the job, attending the go- Welcome to Animal Crossing, the live game that's happening every minute of every day, whether you're playing or not. Hey, it's called the lawnmower. Other people have to live here too, you know. Ready to eat for everyone. Here's the true story. A four friends pick to live in a video game. And find out what happens when they stop being themselves. And start being someone else. Animal, Animal Crossing, Crossing for Nintendo, Nintendo GameCube. GameCube. Today I was like, let's redecorate the house. And I was like, Maybe we should buy some furniture first. Nice outfit. Where'd you get it? A garbage dump? Uh, yeah. Welcome to Animal Crossing, the live game that's happening every minute of every day, whether you're playing or not. Winter's coming soon. Should I make pants for that? Ready to eat for everyone. Here is the true story. Of four friends picked to live in a video game. And find out what happens when they stop being themselves. And start being someone else. Animal, Animal Crossing, Crossing for Nintendo GameCube. Game a sheep moved into the village today. Sweet. Why am I always the one organizing the treasure hunts? Maybe I'd like to sit around blasting techno music all day. Welcome to Animal Crossing, the live game that's happening every minute of every day, whether you're playing or not. I'll trade you some wallpaper for your UFO. You think I'm a chump? Try the raccoon. Ready to eat for everyone. Here's the true story. A four friends pick to live in a video game. And find out what happens when they stop being themselves. And start being someone else. Animal, Animal Crossing, Crossing for Nintendo, Nintendo GameCube. GameCube. Nobody wants to trade insects with me, no matter how many notes I leave them. Why am I always the one cleaning the house and picking the peaches? Where's my big fat hammock time? So tense. Welcome to Animal Crossing, the live game that's happening every minute of every day, whether you're playing or not. So do you want to swap fossils with me later, or...? 
rigidity for everyone. So, uh, chat, do, do you want to swap fossils with me later, or, uh... <laughs> I think we're gonna make Rob first. For some reason, he's the one who stood out. He's also the one who asked to trade fossils, so. Um, you're welcome, if you hadn't seen that before. <laughs> Was there a balloon in the background? Oh, it's all good. I'm not too fussed. Um, but yeah, what I'm gonna do here really quickly, actually, I'm actually just gonna mute this because you guys don't need to hear it, really, um, is I need to take a screenshot of all the characters just so that I remember what they all look like. Uh, do, 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 do. Was it this one? Okay, that's Jeff. Okay. Um, would someone mind, like, one of the mods, could you guys, like, screenshot that quickly for me? Just each of the characters so I know who's who. You have to make his phrase on his passport one of some fossils. <laughs> Found pics of them all. Awesome. Because I'm, I'm going to forget who looks like what, so. I guess it doesn't really matter. You can change your character at any point in this game, so. Um, I'm still trying to process that video. Yeah, I hope that you, uh, I hope that you all enjoyed. <laughs> it is very cursed, but I thought it was the funniest thing. Got it. Thank you. And then there's also, um, Leslie. Um, I guess we'll, we'll either replace one of the, the female characters or we'll just mash job, job, <laughs> Jeff and Rob together, job. I've seen some weird stuff, so the video didn't even phase me. <laughs> a modern real world inspired commercial, that'd be amazing. It really is something, isn't it? It's just like, why, you know? Who decided that this was okay? <laughs> Kelly is horrifying, that's me though. <laughs> I think my favorite things were the dancing, uh, the wanna swap fossils, and, um, so where did you get your outfit from the dump? And she's like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I did. Um, because that's a mood also. <laughs> uh, and then we have Rob, who's the first one I think we're going to make just because I like him. He's funny. <laughs> um, and we're going to have to learn how to make the hats. I know people have done it, so I'll look up that online. I think Kelly starts her morning with something stronger than coffee. <laughs> I love this. It's just, I, the funny thing is I had never seen this trailer before until like YouTube many years after this game came out, but I was still just like, what am I looking at? <laughs> Send the images on Discord. Thank you so much. Was Rob the one creeping behind the tree? We're going to have a tree by his house just because. <laughs> Alrighty. So that was the trailers, you guys, if you had never seen them before. Um, could I ask a favor of one of the mods to make a command? Um, I'm gonna send you guys the link for- I'll actually send it in chat as well. Um, for the trailers we just watched. Um, could we have a command that's like exclamation mark characters? And then it, it links and explains that like, these are the characters we're using so that people know. Um, just so we don't have to watch it all over again. I'm the dump, oh my god. <laughs> Uh, if it's not too much to ask, I can do it later as well, but just thinking ahead, um, it might be handy to have. So, we're gonna make Rob, and I have no idea how moving in a character goes. I haven't really made a character, um, ever since the game came out, so, um, uh, this should be interesting. Send to the Discord. Thank you! Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, let's see. What can we do in the meantime? Let's make sure we talk to our characters, or our villagers first. Andrew, I wouldn't mind just like a quick rundown. Like, am I just, I'm making another account on my Switch essentially, right? Well, who's here? How have you been? I feel like there was something I've been meaning to tell you. Cinnamon, what was it? Oh, well, it's gone. <laughs> cursed. <laughs> These are the characters that Crystal's using as a basis. <laughs> Thank you. Awesome, Andrew. Awesome. I'll add that command in the title here. There we go. Exclamation mark cursed is now in the title. 
Can the new character get up and put their house in the right place? Not sure if that might be an issue. Oh, good question. I'll leave a I'll leave a ladder. I'll leave a ladder for them. Um and see if that helps. Uh pop quiz, what do you think I'm thinking about right now? Hat, socks, sweater. Oh, sweaters, obviously. That's right. I want you uh so I want to try to make some for myself, but once I get better at knitting. For now, I'm collecting patterns I like whenever I see them in, in my magazines. Once I can knit well enough, I'll have enough sweater patterns to fill out a whole new fall and winter wardrobe. Oh boy. Auto mod. Why are we like this? Alrighty, I think I turned that up a bit too loud. Is the audio okay, by the way, you guys? Would you guys like it turned up, turned down? I know, um, it's a little bit quieter, um, uh, when it rains, so. Audio's good? Okay, good. Are you gonna take this present back? No, it's fine, don't worry about it. The fact that Ed had to wait a little longer will just make him like it more. All oh, these villagers are far too nice, I'm sorry. Plus, now I get to see the look on his face for myself. Sorry, Julian. <laughs> Gaston, what are you looking at? Oh, oh, he saw something. <laughs> That's not even where your eye is, buddy. That's where your cheek is, my bud. Apparently you can't actually give it back. <laughs> Crystal, it's been too long. I'm sorry. Oh, hey, kiddo, what's on your mind? Uh, the thing I like about now is that it ain't winter and it ain't summer. Don't, don't you dare say that. Don't you dare. It is still summer and I refuse your... <laughs> that look he just gave me. I built a grinding area for the first 5k of mouse for the house, so I have like 10 flower bags ready to plant. Water 10 flowers, sell fruit, catch some bugs. <sighs> True, we're gonna have to make characters. Like, actually, like, give them stuff. Oh. oh okay, that's gonna be fun. Alright, we'll work on it. surveillance camera in the tree. Uh, so Agnes isn't in, but Boots is in. Let's go say hi. Okay, thank you, Andrew. What are you doing? It's wearing the shirt that Mike always liked to wear in this game. Uh, come take a look, booty. I just wanted to read that part out loud. Not gonna believe it, I made a pear umbrella. I was jogging the other day. Alrighty. I think I already have that one. Yes, I do. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Leave it for the new guy. True, but I guess it doesn't really matter because he's not going to be staying long, but I could always do that. Um, where's Agnes? Because I, I saw her a while back and I want to make sure I talk to everyone at least once. I've had a bad habit of just ignoring my villagers while I'm working. <laughs> do, 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 do. She can't, I don't think she'll have gone down to the lower layer. That's the thing. She has to be up here somewhere. I think. Oh, unless she went in a building, maybe? Alright, scratch that. I have no idea where she is. <laughs> no idea. Okay, well, let's go put this ladder down. And... You know, can I go buy a secondary ladder, actually? Maybe buy some tools for them. We do have an you'd have an Ollie cam today. I hope you guys enjoy it. He is a sweet boy and he deserves all the love, so I mean he's sometimes a sweet boy. Pink wall. Rosie, did you want it? 
Also, Rosie, were you saying that you wanted uh, black street lights yesterday? Oh, whoopsie, I don't have any monies on me. Oh, that's awkward. Yes, okay, just DM me, okay? Because I will forget. Like, actually, like, right now. I won't remember. I know myself too well. Well, Key, how much do bushes sell for? Because I think I have too many on me right now. Oh, all right, never mind. Oh, hey, Lobo! You guys found him faster than I did. Okay, we need some more mutton. Uh, mutton buttons, so... Um... I think I was working on selling stuff yesterday. I do to you. Because I'll forget. <laughs> no worries. No worries. Um, oh god, that's not the right button. Okay. Does anyone else just end up having, like, massive duplicates of, like, everything? Um, especially, like, craftable stuff. And it's just, like, you know, this is just kind of your life now. Am I just starting this island? No, this is actually the one we started last year on the first day the game came out. Uh, we're just doing a new theme. See, like, I don't want to get rid of, like, some of the seasonal stuff, you know? But I know that <laughs> I'm not going to need all of these. Especially all of these. Um, I should probably sort that out. And I, I definitely don't need that many DIY workbenches. Uh, let's see. And, like... <laughs> The, it gets a bit excessive, but some of these were gifted by you guys, so, like, I'm not getting rid of them, you know? I'm keeping these. I need those. <laughs> yes, you do. <laughs> um... God, man, I have too much stuff. Oh, God, I gotta sneeze. Sorry. Oh, thank goodness for mute buttons. Why do I have so many trash cans? <laughs> thank you for the blesses and skeletons, apparently, for some reason. Um, but, like, I crafted these, you know, and I don't want to get rid of them. Or, like, I earned these, but I probably can get rid of them. Uh, what else do we have multiple of? I don't need two bikes. Learn about something and suddenly you see it everywhere because I read a cursed copy pasta recently and now I'm seeing an actual reference to it everywhere, but I want to go back to not knowing. Oh no! See, I'd ask, but I probably also do not want to know. Um, so I just won't. <laughs> oh, the jail bars are from the doll jail. Do you guys remember that? That was fun. There we go. Um, probably don't need more of these. That's a throwback. <laughs> it was fun. One day I would love to actually bring that back. It was good times. These are mainly you guys. I don't think I ever actually got one of those myself. It was just gifted by you guys. Um... Let's see... I'm not getting rid of the ducks. I'm not getting rid of those because I would like to bring back the doll jail. <laughs> um, puppy. That actually reminds me of a story. It's my favorite season. Ooh, uh, the cherry blossom season is really, really pretty, but I'm a huge fan of summer. Um, and I really like the fireworks events, so probably like August. Uh, then about. I don't know, what about you guys? But, uh, the story I was thinking of... When I was a kid, there were these stuffed cat dolls that had the little, like, purple...
purr rattle things in them, if you know what I mean. Like when it moved, it would like make a purring noise. And they had these massive, really sad eyes on them. They're little stuffed toys, pretty much. And uh, I think we were either moving or I was cleaning out some space in my room. I was much older, you know, I no longer used them, no longer wanted them. And I think it was, it was either, I don't remember, I don't think I threw them out. I think it was a donation bin, but it was like a tall one. So you had to like chuck stuff up and into it. God, I got to sneeze again. Sorry. Oh man, I might take a reactant soon. Sorry about that. Anyway, um, so I had this bag full of stuffed toys and like other stuff like that that I didn't need anymore, including these purring cat dolls. And as I tossed it up and over into the bin, all you hear is this symphony of purrs. <laughs> and it actually broke me inside. I got really sad about it. Um, even though, you know, I had never used them since I was a kid and like, you know, I, I didn't have any need for them anymore, but that did make me really sad. <laughs> there we go. That's more like it. Um, so, oh, can you not buy a ladder? Really? Today I learned. Okay. Um, well, I guess I'll just leave some tools out for other person then. Definitely bad day for allergies. I'm sneezing a lot today. Just like yesterday. Yeah, yesterday I had like a lot of coughing fits. Oh, hey, Espeon. How's it going? 18 month resub. That second sub, baby. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. How are you doing today? Goodness. Um... Yeah, let's go ahead and grab. You know what I'd really like? Um, if you had a crafting table in your house, if it actually pulled from your main inventory, that would be nice. Okay. Bug net. Um, you don't really need an axe, but I'll get you one anyway. Watering can. Um, and a spare ladder. There you are. That should be everything they need. Oh, well, I don't have a shovel, though. Okay, we'll get them a shovel. Um, let's see. I remember deleting or selling some crafting tables, and now I'm not going to be able to find them again. Hands down. Oh, wait, there it is. Um, I guess we'll like shove it right over here. Hey, Christy, how's it going? Also, a question to you guys when you guys are navigating through a menu in this game or in any other game, do you guys use the control stick or do you use the D pad? Out of curiosity, I usually use the D pad habit for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, D-pad, D-pad as well. Depends on the game, but I tend to use the D-pad also. I need hardwood and iron. Probably D-pad as well. So I'm sick for movement, but D-pad for menus, yeah. I don't like where the bridge that I just put down, I already gave donations to it, so I thought I could just cancel it. Apparently you don't have your money back compared to when you switch the buildings. Really? That's horrible to know. I'm sorry about that, Rosie. But hey, how's it going? Welcome on in. Switch between them depends on the game and what I go for first, yeah. Control stick, the D-pad isn't good on the Pro Controller, and the Joy-Cons have a D-pad, not sure. Sorry, doesn't have a D-pad, not sure what I, I would do if I had a proper D-pad, though. How come you don't like the uh, D-pad on the Pro Controller, if you don't mind my asking? Is it like the texture, the spongy feel? 
Yeah, the August fireworks are really nice. Okay, this should be enough to get, um, I guess, Rob started here. <laughs> this is exciting. I've never done this before. This is the first time for me. Consider the arrows on the Joy-Cons a D-pad. It's the same concept. I mean, yeah. I would, I personally would call it that as well. I wouldn't know what else to call it, I guess. Okay, so we're just gonna drop all this here. And I think I want to drop that also. And I guess we'll drop that also. So they have a net, a shovel, fishing rod, axe, ladder, and water and can. They shouldn't need a vaulting hole thing. Finally got back, uh, back into playing Animal Crossing the Horizons again. Hope you've been enjoying it. Thinks I'm pressing up or down when I'm pressing the side, which wasn't really a problem with Nintendo's other D pads. Yeah, I've noticed. Um, I always feel like my controller or is like picking up false inputs or drifting when I'm in the like donation menu, if that makes sense, like selecting how much money. Okay, so let's save and we'll come back to Crystal after we make Rob, I think. Skip time to October so the grass oh would change to a little bit darker yeah I know the fall in this game is really pretty who's Rob Courtney let me let me show you there you go if you watch that you will know who Rob is <laughs> Because for anyone else in here, I'm so happy that we have this now. <laughs> also, I downloaded this yesterday, you guys. I haven't actually tried it yet. I figured maybe we could try it together for like a cozy stream sometime. Uh, but I'm very, very excited to play it. So I had a bit of a rough day yesterday. I felt like I needed something to make myself feel better. <laughs> okay, so... How do I make a new character? Users. Add a user. Uh, create a new user. Um, he's gonna be a yellow Pikmin. And his name is Rob. <laughs> name of the game with the kitty and the sword. I missed it. Uh, Kataria Fables. I think it's pronounced. Uh, no. <laughs> Rob is not that fancy. What were the other two? Actually, you know what? We'll do one at a time. We'll do one at a time. But yeah, there is, uh, there it is again for anyone who wants to know. Three users on my Switch. Only two are used in your Animal Crossing game. Yeah. All right. First time. I have never, ever done this before. This should be interesting. Oh, Mendelin, yeah, no, I, I honestly, I want to actually do a first impression stream with you guys for, for like a cozy stream one day. Um, just kind of need to find the time to, uh, to do that. Yeah. I've been really tired at night and I really want to do cozy streams, but I'm just like, I am, I'm exhausted. <laughs> I need to rest. And then I usually end up not resting. Needed room for items. Yeah, I totally get it. I, uh, I haven't run out quite yet, which is a bit surprising. Oh, this is weird. I don't like this. <laughs> this is strange. Good morning, we're so excited to have you here. Welcome to the check-in counter for your big moving day trip to Lily Bell. There is so much to look forward to, but first let's introduce ourselves. I'm Timmy with Nook Inc. 
And I'm Tommy. Two of us are already living on Lilywell. We were there to support everyone, uh, including you. Think of us as your partners. We're in it for the long haul, so let's get started, shall we? Now, let's walk through the steps to get you moved onto the island. The first step is checking your application. Is this your first time applying for one of our packages? Uh, I, I guess so. March 20th, 2020. <laughs> Uh, understood. Now then, we'll need to look up your application. Can we have your name and birthday? Oh! Okay, uh, what? When are we gonna have Rob's birthday? Anyone have, like, a birthday for, like, a Rob? Four twenty. Done. That was easy. Rob, Rob, let's see. Oh, yes, here you are. The next level will be to take a picture of you, Rob. Oh, don't worry. Uh, take as much time as you need to get yourself looking just the way you want. Be ready when you are. There we go. Okay, time to make Rob. So he... They were all looking kind of pale, let's face facts. Um, and he... We don't really know what hair he has underneath. <laughs> Oh, sorry. Um, so we might go something like this. We're gonna make him like a blonde. Well, actually, no, his hair's blue under there, I think. So we're gonna have to like change this later. Maybe we'll make it black for now. No, not on our list. <laughs> Bald. Um, and he had he had this going on. I think that's definitely the one. Just for another birthday to be June 9th, so it's 6-9 short. Also, Jackie with the two month wait, two months, two year. There we go. Resub, thank you. How are you doing today? Much appreciated. And his eyes are like kind of like this grayish dark blue. I'll probably leave it default. Um, he had the triangle nose, so did everyone else, and we'll leave the wider smile. And that's all he gets. This is- this is- <laughs> That shirt looks like something he would wear. Does the skull shirt exist anymore? Does anyone know? Am I gonna have to go find a design for it? Probably exists. Six of September. <laughs> okay, so for now, this is going to be Rob. I love how he's wearing the exact same outfit I was wearing when I first came to the island. <laughs> Oh, sorry. I'm doing really good today. Great, you're all set. Just go ahead and add that picture to your records. That concludes everything we need to do here. Don't worry, we'll give you an in-depth overview of island life once we're back on the ground. Are we gonna have the introductory video? I'm ready to cry again. That video always gets me. Thank you for taking this charred flight to Lilybell. Please sit back, relax, and enjoy a free video about Nooking Scissor Island getaway package. Oh no. I'm gonna get emotional. I'm glad I'm not on camera. This hit me hard the first time I saw it. We are making uh, three other characters, actually. This is the first one. If every commercial leading up to it wasn't 
a variation of it pretty much i did like how all the commercials featured like the same characters that was kind of fun there was always the one guy asleep in the background it's hard to believe it's been over a year it's weird right it was just i feel like a lot of my emotions from that just come from the fact that we'd waited so long and there have been like i know every single trailer that came out you know we were analyzing it on stream we were hyping each other up like it was a big deal <laughs> So, gosh, we look really empty from above. We're going to have to start filling things in here. Oh, look at our icon, you guys. Our icon is fall. Oh, I hate it. <laughs> oh, God, I forgot what we looked like. I hope you enjoy your flight. Would you please join us for a short orientation session? Our fearless leader himself will be giving you a presentation, so I'd hate for you to miss it. Played at midnight on release. President Nook, I've got Rob here. Yes, yes, very good. Hello, hello, so you're our new resident Rob. Welcome to Lilybell. Tom Nook, manager of this island and president and CEO of Nook Inc. Virtually, this was a deserted island, so Nook Inc. offered a deserted island getaway package. We're a lot less deserted now, but we still accept new residents. Now, Rob, as to the matter of where you'll rest your sleepy head at night. There, a little comfort item for you. And, uh, I'm terribly sorry, but due to a slight mix-up, we weren't able to prepare a place for you to live yet. If you could, take a look around and set up your tent wherever you like. That shouldn't be a problem, right? After all, it's in keeping with our original deserted island theme. There's something else you need as well. I do have to pay off their loans. Yeah, I'm not gonna have their full houses. I'm gonna have the first house you get, and that's it, actually. Um, because in my original GameCube copy, we only have the one character, so only one house will be fully expanded. Ah, uh, it's your very own Nook phone. I had these made especially for island residents. I want to make sure it's working right, so could you try turning it on for me? Good, good. Looks like you're getting the good, uh, good reception as well. Get KK Techno. I'm gonna see if I have it already. Uh, feel free to put it away now. On my other character, of course. Uh, say, Rob, have you ever used a smartphone before? Uh, yep. Very good, then this should be a breeze for you. Uh, the most important item of all... Your build. <laughs> Uh, so this includes everything, airfare, accommodations, labor, tax, and of course your Nook phone. Hey, Pavo, how's it going? Bring your grand total. Okay, we can do that. Okay. You've, uh, huh? Hey, Rob, you don't have any money at all. Oh no, no bells, Rob. It's crazy, honestly. So many customers arrive here without two bells to rub together. Well, no need to worry. I was prepared for exactly this type of tricky situation. With the getaway package, you can pay your fees with miles instead of the standard bells. I call this extremely helpful service the Nook Mileage Program. That bug got right in our faces. Okay, so I'm going to skip through this if you guys don't mind, because we know what this all is. Uh, Kirsty, no. He'll come the next day, I think. Or the day before. Actually, I think it's be the next day because the day before was the bug off. Oh, my new life is underway. I can do whatever I want within reason, Rob. Within reason. Alright. This is a family friend. I just realized something. It was raining. It was raining before. Does it- I guess it just always gets sunny when someone new moves in? I've never seen so many birds on that post before. Oh god. Okay, um... Give me a second. Wanna swap fossils? Okay, Nook Miles, Nook Miles, Nook Miles, yep. Great. It was definitely raining earlier. That's really weird. I just tweaked it. Okay, we have our bug and fish stuff. 
I'm just getting through all the tutorial messages or else it'll bug me. Oh, that's so weird to see another human player. There we go. Uh, rescue service. Nope, don't need it. <laughs> Why is the new character moving in? Because we're trying to fill up the houses for our GameCube theme. In the GameCube version of the game, there are four player houses who are um, there from the beginning of the game, even if no one's moved in. And um, we got to get those four houses in, so. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. Oh wait, that's so weird. You start with terraforming? Oh, I'm not used to this. That's a, that's interesting. Oh, right, and we share custom designs. Right, I remember people being really upset about that. Because you couldn't use another character for extra slots. <laughs> right. Oh, but we only have some of them because... That's interesting, we hadn't bought the next upgrade. Uh, alrighty. Let's take a look. Oh, Gaston! <laughs> what a sweet boy. Yeah, at the moment I'm not having... Oh, my inventory is so small. I'm not having people over. Uh, to be honest, when it comes to this game, I'm kind of like, you know, what's the point? Uh, there's nothing really to do when you have people over, unfortunately. In the future, when they give us some more uh, mini games to do, I'll be a little bit more interested. Oh, I don't even have the D-pad thing. Gosh, this is weird. Okay, let's go put our house down. Um, should we have Rob behind Crystal? Where do you guys think we should have him? We have him beside, diagonal, or behind. No one reads a book under a tree like Gaston. <laughs> I don't really know. Like, I, all the spots are the exact same, obviously. Yeah, I hope that they add in some more minigames. Because, like, right now, you come over and see someone's island, and, like, that's pretty much all you can do. Unless they have something set up ahead of time and just... Behind, so you could hide behind his tree? Okay. Sounds good. Talk about crystal? Yeah. Okay, so we're all kind of thinking the same thing. There we go. That's how we wanted it. <laughs> Isn't that weird? Okay. Oh, I can't pick up his mailbox yet. True, that's gonna be a bit annoying. I might actually have to upgrade their house a bit further. I really don't want to, but that's exactly where I want the gyroid to go. Gosh darn it, Rob. You're making this more difficult than I thought. There we go. For now, that'll go there. I stayed for about three months and I won't come back until there's some reason to play again. Monster Hunter Rise and Breath of the Wild have already taken over your life. Well, I'm glad you've been enjoying those, honestly. Uh, thanks for using the specially colored Joy-Con controllers released in association with New Horizons. Oh, that's weird. I'm not actually using them right now, but I guess it's sensing that it's attached to my dock or like to my Switch itself because I'm using the Pro Controller. Weird. Free stuff. <laughs> God, I'm not used to this. This is the weirdest thing to see, like, everything at the beginning again. Hey, Rick Slade, how's it going today? Welcome on in. Oh, it's a workbench. Okay, I should probably go learn about that. Alrighty, so once again, if anyone's just joining us and you're like, who is this? This is Rob. <laughs> uh, we're going to be having three new characters, including Rob. 
uh, move on to the island so we have the four player houses, just like in the GameCube version of the game. Uh, he is not permanent, he will not be staying long term, but for this theme, he will be here, so. Uh, we have to get his house up and up and ready. Making dinner? I hope your dinner turns out well. What are you having? <laughs> Look at him! The dedication! The focus! <laughs> Really don't want to go through the hassle, yeah. But Courtney, yeah, it definitely feels like it. It's a bit weird. Oh, you know what? Rachel, they may have. Yeah, my workshop. Here we go. This is weird because I'm used to taking this in the tent. Okay, so don't mind me. I'm going to be skipping through a lot of the uh, dialogue here. Uh, just because we know how to play the game. We know how to um, do DIYs and stuff like that. So at least I hope we do after this is long. Suspiciously cheap spring rolls. Not sure how I get six of them for just a dollar, but hey, money. You know what? Sometimes you gotta, gotta save a bit for sure. I hope that they're good. You never know, they might actually be really good. Look at how many birds. <laughs> okay, so we need sticks. This could be interesting. Um, let's go find some trees. <laughs> Actually, can I? I can just shake them, can't I? It's been a long time since I've done this. Yeah, you can comes on too soon. I can go back to eating regular priced foods that are bad for me. There you go. That's the spirit. Oh, hi. Sorry. Are you Rob, the one who just moved here? I knew it. I'm Rod. Oh, I never realized how close they are. The greatest dude on the island. Greatest at what? Greatest at putting up with muscle soreness. That's what. Anyway, see you around. I'm... Not good at that. As I found out yesterday, I was complaining all day about my arms. Okay, that should be enough sticks. <gasps> Bob and Gaston are sitting under a tree. Stay. Stay. Stay, 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 stay. Bob did this thing where he looked over at Gaston for a second, and I want to see if I can catch it again. Gaston looks so fed up with everything. <laughs> Come on. You can do it. Oh. Okay. Alright, well we got a picture at least. <laughs> I am Gaston while studying. Best friends. <laughs> Okay, let's get this DIY. Hey, random gamer, how are you doing today? Welcome back. Oh, wait, yeah. <laughs> right, we're, we're crafting. I didn't need to hand them my own fishing rod. Oh, well, that's okay. It's fine. Okay, free DIY workshop. Common DIY recipes. Lauren, how are you doing today? Oh, 
All right, cool. So that should be some Nook Miles right there that we can work on with their uh, fishing and bug catching and stuff. Um, let's take a look. I'm gonna do the other characters off stream. I'll probably at least make them all on stream so you guys can see them, but I'll probably, like, I might work on getting their houses off stream. We'll see how it goes. I should probably actually read these. Uh, catch fish, catch bugs. Uh, chatting with residents. Uh, number of DIY recipes you've collected, okay. DIY tools. Flower power. Specialty fruits. Go ahead and be shellfish. I can't really do that, these two right now with the whole clam thing because our beach is full. Yeah, Ollie's really calm right now. Uh, how many things you've put in your house? We can actually put down one more thing and get some more. Customize their profiles. It's our catalog. We won't really do that one. Bulletin board benefit. Write something on the bulletin board. <laughs> God. That's what I meant about uh, sometimes feeling like this drifts a bit. with his grandma friends through a dreamscape right now would not surprise me. You gotta add in the little little face. I don't even know what I'd call that face, but I love using it. Uh, bulletin board benefit. Um. Oh, island flag. No, no, that won't happen. This is a designer app. Okay. We can do that. Um, I'll just like do something really quickly. Is blue. <laughs> That's going to be the design for now because I think that'll count. This is kind of fun. I like I miss having lots of Nook Miles to do, I'm not gonna lie. We've gotten to the point on our character now where like we've done so many of them and it's just like, oh. Well, just like that, it just lets you in. Oh, I need to go buy the other things. Oh, can I like... Okay, that did do something. Good. At least I get that much done. I feel like I'm speed running. <laughs> Just speed running getting the 5,000 Nook Miles. Maybe dumb question, is it actually possible to pay off with bells? I'm assuming it isn't because no one mentioned it, but like, oh god. Could I like, leave bells on the ground for them to pick up and pay off? Oh, 
love how the Nook Mouse is supposed to be easier, but it's much faster to earn bells. Yeah. I think it, it's marketed as easier, but I think it's mostly it's just like, oh, hey, here's how you get to learn the game, pretty much. Gosh darn it. Uh -huh. Oh. Gosh darn it. Hey, Emma, welcome on in. My name is Crystal. Pronouns are she and her. I hope you're having a good day. Welcome on in. And thank you for asking, also. <laughs> that bug did say bye. If anyone is just joining us, though, for the first time, welcome on in. We're working on our Animal Crossing GameCube theme town at the moment. We've just created our first secondary character for our player area. If you've ever played the original Animal Crossing GameCube, there's like this spot where there are four player houses from the very beginning of the game. And that's actually kind of what I'm trying to recreate here. So that's why we're playing as Rob at the moment. <laughs> we have September bugs, you know it. <laughs> So happy to get this area finished. Although I will say, I know that some people didn't like that you share de uh, designs between characters, but it's nice because if I accidentally erase something as like Rob or whoever else, I can like sort it out on this character. If that makes sense. Fauna. Should probably talk to her. We haven't met yet. I'm Fauna and you're Rob. Great to meet you. So fun to see a fresh face around here. I hope we'll get to be friends. And I have a question for you. Don't overthink your answer. You're about to enjoy a cup of tea. So what kind of tea are you having? I don't really have a preference, but I'm more likely to drink black tea over anything else. Been very busy lately, and you need to take time off to relax. Does this? I swear, sometimes this game, it like it knows. <laughs> also, Twitter when the wind changes direction. <laughs> hey, PG Keen, how's it going? Oh, see, I can't donate them to the museum because our museum's already finished. Does that... Forgive me for not knowing. If I was to start a new character in this town, like, on purpose, like, actually... Would I... I wouldn't be able to donate them, right? Oh, this is actually just for filling out your critterpedia, I guess. Current designs are related to how it needs to download all custom designs of an island when you visit? Yeah. And the game already lags badly enough, to be honest, when you're visiting Dream Towns and there's a lot of design boards and stuff, so I'm honestly not too fussed about it. A few more guests online, and something still to interact with the person that uses the command one day will get to 1,000 lines. Gaston command is one of my favorites still. So. I have not bought any turnips, no. Um, I forgot to sell turnips on our GameCube town, though. And I thought about it this morning, and I'm like, well, that's some money down the drain, but it's okay. Did I actually have a Lily of the Valley spawn up there? Do you guys see that? I shouldn't have had one spawn. My town is definitely not perfect right now. Maybe I left it. Great, I just run out of ideas for for long periods of time, and then all of a sudden you have like massive ideas. I get it completely. Happy to be able to catch the stream. I'm glad to have you when you're able to be here. Oh, wait a minute. We actually did something. There we go. Just over halfway there.
I guess I should probably be decorating their, um, their character houses as well. I don't necessarily need to, but I kind of want to see if I can. Um, I'm thinking for Rob's house, we'll do full of, like, the old-fashioned skull radios and stuff like that. Um, have the techno song on. Maybe for, like, Kelly or Leslie, we'll have, like, either pink or blue, because I think that's what they were wearing. Uh, yes. Okay, two thousand more. Um, let's do some fishing, maybe. See, I, <laughs> I miss having the item wheel so I could easily switch between stuff already. Also, wait a minute, I can learn these now, right? Isn't it weird this is making me want to start a new... A new save file off stream? I already have two towns, I really shouldn't have another, but I kind of want to have another now. Looking so good, I'm watching the bots for the leader in my spare time, so it's so cool to see the progress. Thank you so much for watching those, I've been having such a blast playing that game on stream. And uh, I'm glad you've been enjoying that also. Um, and recreating it has definitely been a project. Three is the magic number. <laughs> no crystal bad. <laughs> yeah, because I do have the switch light that I can make another one on. Um, I just don't, you know, you don't want to burn yourself out. But something about the beginning of the game and like how nice and calming it is. <laughs> Rebecca, I really don't want to, but I kind of want to move the cucumber, at least for Captain, because I'm pretty sure he's meant to like cucumbers. I don't know about the eggplant, though. <laughs> we'll think about it. Okay, we don't really have many fish over here, do we? Oh, I keep- Oh, right! You can switch between them this way! I forgot about that. It's like New Leaf. Oh man, the good old days. <laughs> Before the, the item wheel, which is now my favorite thing. I missed that butterfly because of that. I should probably actually talk to my villagers here. Introduce myself. Hey there, my new snack buddy. My name's Bob, and snacks are my thing. And bugs. Bugs and snacks are my thing. And saying man a lot, too. Like, man, snacks, and bugs, right? That's basically me, but you, you just moved here, right? Man, I can't wait to find out what your thing is. Even if it's not bugs and snacks, we'll still be friends. Was it mango? Oh my god. That would be cute, though. Like, fruit-based fishing lures. Don't know how well it would work, mind you, but... Then again, there is a fishing lure in this game that is a rubber duck, so I can't really judge. Bug snack. It would be Bug Snacks. I think we found Bob's favorite game. Which, by the way, if you do not play Bug Snacks yet, do yourself a favor. It's an awesome game. It's not very long, it doesn't overstay its welcome. It's a lot of fun and it's on lots of different platforms. I will not shut up about it. It's a good game. <laughs> bunger, bunger. <laughs> it doesn't. No, I actually went through and got rid of some of the old commands for uh, for the games. Actually, random. I was thinking in our command list, like in the the document for them. Do you think it'd be a good idea to have one specifically for, like, whatever game we're playing at the moment? So it's 
general commands, mod commands, and then uh, game commands, just because they're very temporary usually. Like, I went through and I had to get rid of uh, our Stardew mods one yesterday because it was still sitting there and I haven't played Stardew in months on stream. Thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. <laughs> Link to the bunker plush. <laughs> Okay, how much space do we have? We'll go back up, buy some flower seeds. Plant them. Follow uh, Andrew's advice. <laughs> Ooh, do you need it now? We're, um, we're having our grocery order come in today, around lunchtime, so very, very soon. And, uh, low-key, always my favorite day. <laughs> always my favorite day because there's always so much, so much to snack on. Oh. Oh. Dear lord. I think it's a good idea. I need to go through my end of the bot later. Copy so I steal the data from your end onto mine and update the command list. Yeah, let me know if you need anything. Um, last night you guys... Random was kind of helping me go through, and Andrew's, uh, helping me go through and sort out, uh, the bot. So, once again, if anything isn't working quite right today, assume that was me breaking something. Oh, just let that go. Oh, I like how Rod ran when I let go of that bug. <laughs> Need a Pepsi if that counts. I would send you one, but... I only send good soft drink. No, I'm joking, I'm joking, please don't hate me. Um, I actually don't have any. I do have some Coke Zeros though, if you want those, because I'm not eating them. Eating them? Drinking them. You eating cans? Apparently I <laughs> There's one that doesn't work. Yeah, I, I remember thinking yesterday there was one that wasn't working right, so I don't remember which one it was. Okay, my island uh, layout on the island designer app. I don't know Ooh, what to do with the shops. I tend to like to have my shops all together in like a shopping district. That's just me, though. I've always liked how that looks. Caffeine free cook somewhere in the house. There you go. Um, okay, so that's just catching, like, a certain amount of fish. Right. Let's go back in and buy some flower seeds. Not that I need more flowers, but just for Rob. <laughs> Forgot about because I'm just not used to drinking sodas. I've turned on Redeem Pokemon on my end for now. Have a look later. Y that was the one, right. I could get the Redeem Animal Crossing one working, but that one, for some reason, was just like, no. Uh, oops, we have mums in today. I love mums. <laughs> They're my favorite. Well, high sense, but new favorite. Man, this aluminum can tastes great. <laughs> Guys, has there ever been a food in a video game that you've really wanted to eat? It can be realistic looking, it can be not realistic looking, it can be a fake food that doesn't actually exist. Or drink, even. Milton. Okay, random. <laughs> Some people here want chocobo. This is true. That's true. Maybe I shouldn't be asking this question. Uh, okay, Rob, you're gonna have a little garden next to your house, buddy. Okay, Rob, you don't have any space for a garden next to your house. Crystal is gonna have a garden next to her house. Sea salt ice cream, papu fruit from Kingdom Hearts, yes. I have had sea salt ice cream, though. In person. I will say, it's kind of neat. It's kind of neat. I liked it. Mm. 
Wait, lady, hello, how's it going? Welcome on in. I'm having a pretty chill day today. I hope you are as well. There we go. I don't actually know if I actually needed like this many, but must taste similar to star fruit. Yeah, I kind of have this idea of what it would taste like as well, but I'm not quite 100% sure. Okay. Hopefully it doesn't count that these are already watered because the rain earlier that the game suddenly forgot about. Sensu beans. Oh, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. I hope your day is going well. Okay, let's see if this actually did something. Flower power. There we go. Um, okay, what else can we get really easily? How many bells you've spent? So we can spend a bit more. Um, exterior decorator. Number of furniture items you set up outside. Okay, I'm not going to change our flag or anything. I can't get this one just yet. Still has green soon because of Kingdom Hearts. I wonder if I can find a vegan recipe. You might, you might. Um, when I made my sea salt ice cream, it was many, many years ago now, but it wasn't really that complicated, so... Hopefully you can find one. Okay, let's do some more fishing, maybe. Suspiciously cheap spring roll verdict. Pretty good! I'm glad that you like it! That's always great. Hate catching these. Nice. I keep trying to press up on the D pad to get to the item wheel. It's really bad. <laughs> if you see me just pause, I'm like thinking about it. No one fishes without looking like Kesta. Oh, I found a cam. empty can should be repurposed. I've got an idea for a DIY recipe. Does that- that just automatically goes in, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Okay. Thinking these are like massive bugs. That was a Coke can that somebody threw away because they realized Pepsi was better. Rude. <laughs> Yesterday, you guys in the Discord, I uh, I sent a picture that I found on Reddit of um, someone pouring a big bottle of Coke into a Pepsi like takeout cup. And uh, I just I post it with the caption disrespectful, I think. And uh, yeah, that's one thing Random and I can agree on. It was disrespectful to both of us. <laughs> but why throw it in the water? Because some people. Oh, oh, that's sad. Some people are mean. I don't care about the environment. Oh, actually, that was really good. Never mind. I'm happy that we broke that. Okay, we'll do some fishing then. <laughs> Concussions, no. Oh, jeez. first day when we streamed this. I guess the first day it came out, right? Um, just running around. I think I 
I figured out, I think I fished up a boot from the water and then my character's like, oh, this gives me an idea for a DIY. And I like panicked and I'm like, I can make my own boots. And it was like a whole thing. Um, I think that was about like 30% of our stream that day <laughs> was me fishing for another boot. That was really fun. Oh, there we go. There's something new. Long time trying to find a boot. <laughs> I was just, I was so excited. The DIY system was really new and really cool. I was here for it, you know? Hey, Gorky, how's it going? How much item space do I have? Okay, we're starting to run out here. We cracked the boots and now he lives here. <laughs> Ooh, god goodness me. Hi! That prob- I probably shouldn't have caught that with my own hand. Well, the DIY boots as well for them for a surprisingly long time in the beginning? Yeah. I was very attached to the rugby outfit, which is not like me at all, but I thought it was cute. Oh, you got the ace and eight switch. Nice. <clears throat> I'm doing pretty good. Um, we just started a new character on Lily Bell for um, housing purposes, and we're trying to get his his house set up right now, pretty much. So we're trying to get like five thousand nook miles. There we go. And uh, I can. How much is this? It's probably far too much for me, right? Oh, that sticker shock. Nope. Actually, you know what? Maybe I'll buy another bug net because we do need to buy something for more Nook Malls anyway. Let's get another bug net going here. Uh, apparently that wasn't enough. <laughs> to start your new island. I hope you're having fun with it. Um... Uh... I'm 100 bells off? Okay. Alright, game. I see you. I see you. Um... Buy a slingshot, maybe. Hey, Diaz, how are you doing today? Trying to find one you like? Yeah. I know finding, like, that ideal layout is kind of a bit tricky. And then maybe if we're lucky, if the game throws balloons at me like it usually does. There's a skull. Is it actually, it's actually in the evils, like, properly? Because that's really handy. Hey, no worries, Sandra. I hope you have a good day. I'm sorry you're a little bit rushed. Just looked up. Awesome. Okay, so Crystal... Probably, I like him. My other, my character, uh, probably doesn't have that as her, like, in her, uh, catalog, but we can always check. Oh. There we go. I have the skull tease if you don't. Yeah, um... I'll check, I guess, with, with the other character and see. I wish I could, like, check right now. Like, you know, easily, but... 
Actually, how much do I need for that can? Oh, I need 10 weeds. I definitely don't think I have 10 weeds in town right now. <laughs> Take a quick look, see, but usually things are pretty clean. Especially when the town's empty, like it is. Can I look everything except for three things I am trying to sister so I can go look? Oh my god, you definitely have it then. Much respect, but no, um... I'm trying to remember if I've ever bought it. It's, it, it wouldn't be like me to buy it, so... Do, 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 do. There's some more. See if picking stuff up gets me anything. You know what's funny also? We've played a lot of days in the last, you know, since yesterday and today. Um, no red. <laughs> no real, like, visitor visitors, if you know what I mean. I could have got as a gift, that's very true. I have a lot of stuff like that that I wouldn't have bought, so... There we go. Oh, wait, don't you get enough moss for hitting rocks? Oh my goodness. Mason, thank you so very much for the biddies. I appreciate that so very much. Thank you. Oh, there's that gold nugget we were talking about yesterday, you guys. Check mail on your other player character. Okay. Yeah, I'll have to do that after. <laughs> the shiny gold nugget is making me feel like royalty of grand idea for a DIY. set of biddies. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. Oh, we got the King Tut mask. Oh. <laughs> All right, and there is the 5,000 we needed. Just like that. That makes things pretty easy. So let's go talk to Tom Nook and get our house sorted. I look on my phone and the SO app is still Japanese outside of my nook like. Oh, wait a minute. Apparently I did something else too. There we go. So I really would love to have all of their mailboxes over by where our post office is going. But I don't think you can move Atari Jinx as well. Thank you. My goodness, thank you so much for the biddies. I really do appreciate that. Um, you guys are spoiling me today. <laughs> um, I really want the post office to have all of their post box or mailboxes or whatever you want to call them. Um, so I might have to upgrade their houses more than I wanted to, unfortunately, but there's only so much you can do about that, right? That'd be so cute. You could have like stacks of books and make a cute little outdoor area. Yeah, I was thinking like obviously like I've seen uh, DIYs for like mail bags and stuff that you put over pillows and I thought that would be cute. Have like the little counter, have like some sort of storage thing. Yeah, I have I have ideas. <laughs> um, I wish I could make it a proper building, obviously, but. There we go. Indeed, that's 5,000 miles and not a mile less. With that, your moving fees have been paid in full. This is a happy day for us both. You're free and clear of debt living on a thriving scenic island. What could be better? Oh, that wasn't actually a rhetorical question. Let me be more specific. How is that tent treating you? <laughs> Thank you. Uh-oh, Brandon's Twitch being funny. I did drop a couple frames there. I think that was on my end. Okay, so we're gonna get a new house here. Zero interest financing and extremely lax repayment plan. <laughs> Honestly, people give shade to Tom Nook, but like he's not that bad. At least in this game. <laughs> Okay, let's talk about that house situation. 
Made a decision about home ownership, ready to move forward into comfort and luxury. It's fun as living in a tent can be. A house gives you more space and helps you put down roots. Um, yeah, let's do it. Eight different colors to the roof. Oh, um... I'm trying to remember what color the top right hand one is. Okay, give me a second, actually. I'm ready for this. Give me a second. Let's go look at our handy dandy reference video here. Um, what color was the roof of that house? So there's an orange one. I know our one is blue. There's a green one. I'm going to look at the this one last. Oh, I hope your kitty cat's doing well. Yeah, so there's our house. Was it red? It probably was. Uh, yes, it was. Okay, so it's red, orange, and green are the house colors that we're going to need. Or roof colors, sorry. There we go. Men's Lynch, are your lurk? <laughs> Questioning yourself there, yes. Okay, there we go. So that should be ready by tomorrow in game. Look, miles plus, yay. Love those. Midnight Wolf, how are you doing today? Welcome on in. Alright, so there is a Rob set. Um, I think I'm gonna sell off some of this stuff, and I'll probably um, drop, like, the items we have for our other... Uh, should I? I could always just craft them with each character, but... Pokemon Shield, I hope you're having fun with it. I've been hearing more and more people getting uh, back into or playing some Pokemon recently, so... That's always fun. Shopping area. Oh, started to lag. That's the worst. It's why, even though I love having, like, the designs and stuff, I always keep it really minimal. So Rob is set. I think what we'll do now is we'll get uh, either Kelly or Leslie and Jeff set up. Um, but we won't actually like fully get all their Nook Miles stuff on stream, I think. Um, just because it is a bit tedious and you just saw me do it once. Um, but we will have their characters and their tents placed so you guys can actually see what they're going to look like. Give or take. <laughs> yeah, flowers breed incredibly fast, which like, I feel like if I had told myself that would be a problem back when we were playing New Leaf, I would have laughed. Oh, well, that's awkward. That's not it at all. <laughs> You don't need anything on your character. Cool. All right. He. Oh. Hi. So, did you know about reactions? Oh, okay. Full of joy. Thank you. Okay. I'm low key here for the Rob and Rod friendship. I think they'd be friends just based on the facts that their names are one letter apart, and like that's it. That's the whole basis of their friendship, and I'm here for it. Alrighty. 
let's go ahead we're gonna save so do you guys think we should do kelly or leslie kelly or leslie as our next character because my character is kind of taking up one of the spaces that they would have taken up if i was making all the characters but um which one do you prefer is it alitax alitax am i saying your name right well come on in Kesley. <laughs> just merge them Think I should do Leslie? Yeah, we'll do Leslie. Hey, Insightful Sloth, hello! Thank you so much for the host, how's it going? I appreciate that. Alright, give me a second, I'll switch over to Big Ollie Cam while I'm doing the boring stuff here. There you go. Look at that sleepy bean. And you guys can still see what I'm doing. Do, do, do. Wrong way, users, bad user, create new user. Um, okay, no, I want, I want the other Pikmin colors. Uh, just because I think that's funny. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> oh my goodness, yes. do i want it to match the background i guess that's probably the closest we're gonna get uh and this is going to be leslie do kelly because she wears pink and you can be leslie because you mainly wear blue this is true that is actually very true, not to mention Kelly does look more funny. And once again, if anyone one is wondering where we're basing these characters off of, you can do exclamation mark cursed. <laughs> if you would like to see this horrible video, pretty much it's the original trailers for Animal Crossing GameCube in North America, but they're really, really weird. Uh, and fair warning, if you don't like costume characters, you might not want to watch it. <laughs> There we go. And I'll keep it on Ollie until uh, the game loads up, because the loading screen takes a while. How's everyone doing today, though? How is your Sunday treating you? David Alexander, how's it going? I hope you're having a good day. Surviving. Also, I might time travel until late afternoon. Oh, since you think your island looks better in the sunset, totally. Alrighty, let's switch back. Very chill walk this morning. My parents and dog. Oh, that's awesome. Alright, so forgive me, I'm not going to read through all this once again. We're going to be doing this a couple times, so. Playing Sims. Be nice and relaxing. That's really nice. Three pause, I don't know if you said earlier, which Sims are you playing? Is it four? Okay, so were we going to do, was it June 9th for her? For her birthday? Because we are mature here. Okay, we're gonna need to think of another birthday for uh, Jeff after this one. <laughs> Alrighty. Um, so she... <laughs> Kelly has some, uh, some stuff going on. Also, her hair's more pink, but we're gonna have it for this for now. And she definitely has the hair plan going on. 
Um, and her eyes are pretty much that. <laughs> That's actually it exactly. Um, or it could be this one, but I think the other one's a bit better. Um, and her eyes are dark also, actually. Sorry, new island? No, no, just creating new characters. Getting properly into the Sims again. I do miss two and three, but four is a good one out of these packs. Yep. She's staring into your soul. Uh, she also has the triangle nose. That's the thing. All the characters essentially look very similar in the original, so. Okay, I might skip the video this time. <laughs> I think someone said I could, so... Whose voice was the boarding announcements? I always, in the back of my mind, I feel like it's Pelly. I don't think it actually is. But, like, my own little head cannon is they're all working at an airport now. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> It does kind of sound like it, doesn't it? Oh, Laura, hello, how's it going? Welcome on in. I hope your day's tr uh, treating you well so far. Pete was replaced by a postcard stand. Yeah, the entire post office was. Okay. So again, I'm just not gonna read all this again. We just read it. We know the spiel. Okay, I really don't know how I feel about her. <laughs> Kelly, she's a little bit scary looking. Love Pocket Camp so much. I, uh, I really couldn't get into it, unfortunately. I just never really play many mobile games. Uh, there we go. Okay, poor Tom Nook is like, why is everyone moving on to my island with no money today? <laughs> Just three people all at once after more than a year of, like, the same characters, pretty much. Have I just been getting really lucky that all my characters have worn the same clothing when they first arrived? Or is it literally every character you make will have the same outfit based on the island? Because I know on my other island I was wearing something different. Okay, um... I need... a ladder. So what is this yelling at me for? What have I done? There we go. How's the island coming along? It's good. We're adding in our uh, player houses here, slowly. <laughs> and uh, 
things are really starting to come together. I think it'll look a lot better when I actually start having trees down, because right now it's very open. So I think I'm actually going to put Kelly back here, and then we'll have Rob here. Or Jeff. I think I'm just lucky. <laughs> games hair plan have that weird flip at the back uh it didn't but in the old games um there was the uh the hat that would cover it i don't know about in like uh new leaf or anything like that though i don't actually remember uh okay andrew no movies i don't know why you're fighting a company but you go you do it you got this And there we go. So now I'm a little bit ticked off about this situation still because I really want it to be in the exact same spot for everyone, but internet died. They're probably messing with, oh, with your stuff again. Is there a link to the path you're using? Yep, exclamation mark, designs. I think it is, there you go. Um, so I have three different cobblestone paths listed in there, but you'll see which one is the newest one based on the episode number. Um, this is the one that we just started using yesterday, so most recent one. <laughs> uh, but if you like to see the others, they're there too, just because I figured I'd probably have people asking. Alright, this is finally starting to feel a little bit more lived in. So this was Kelly. We're not going to finish her stuff right now. We'll, I'll do that off stream, hopefully, if I remember. And we're going to put this back down. And we're going to do this all one more time for uh, Jeff. Yeah, Rob's already done. We already have his house set up. Oh my god, all the... Did you guys see that? He tucked his little face in. <laughs> I've had this cat for over a year and I still will just like stop and drop everything to make a fuss of him. I mean, let's see, I've had my other cat for well over 10 years and I'll still do that also. Oh, baby. Also, Haru, hello, how are you doing? Man, these loading screens though. Okay, last character. Um, I want the red Pikmin. Oh, Ouija! <laughs> do, do, do. What picture do you guys use for your accounts, by the way? Just out of curiosity. Do you guys have a favorite? I've had Luigi for a long time. I think that's kind of how I want it to stay. <laughs> Okay, and this is Jeff. Oh, you have your me design yet? Yeah, you Celeste, Mary Galaxy, Mabel. There we go. I probably should change Rob's thing here. Can I actually change it in here? Just because I didn't change the background color to match the others. There we go. I'm not used to having so many characters. Yoshi Egg, use Captain, Toon Zelda, yeah. Celeste with the purple background. Princess Toadette. I've always liked how um, the backgrounds look when you change it to a darker color in the back, personally. I don't know why. <laughs> I just like how it looks on like the main screen. Ollie, boy, are you looking out the window, baby? Oh, he's like looking out, but he's also like low key starting to doze again. <laughs> they do have an easy life. At least indoor kitty cats do. 
I mean, it's a dark purple background, yeah. Alrighty. And one more time here. And again. <laughs> yep. Yeah, no, Ollie was being a bit of a butt this morning. He was chasing Kiara around, so that's why he's in here with me. He's in kitty cat timeout. But he doesn't really seem to mind. He, I think he's enjoying the air conditioning I have going on in here right now, so. Okay, what was Jeff's birthday, you guys? We've had uh, April 20th, and we've had June 9th. What is his birthday going to be? December 11th. 719. Um... I don't think if there's any other funny numbers, but there's only two I can think of. October 21st. Keyboard's being glitchy. Oh, no worries. Hopefully you get that sorted. It's never any fun. We've already done April 20th, unless you want them to be a twin. July 11th, October 31st. 9-6. Um... Oh? Did I just have an Amazon package come in? I didn't order anything. Why was that going off at me? 7-7? Seven, seven. We could just do like a duplicate number. What was that? I shouldn't have had an Amazon package come in. Weird. Anyway. 7-11. Um... 7-11 is good. There you go. Okay, so Jeff is, um, we don't really know what his hair looks like again, so I think we're just gonna do something like this. Uh, his hair is blue as well, so we're gonna make it gray for the moment, maybe? And he has very... Very interesting eyes. See, I don't think this is it. That's probably a bit closer. I think we'll go with that. And he also has dark eyes. We might change them to all have different eyes, but... Is that your mom's birthday? <laughs> Well, I hope that she had a good birthday, because I that did pass not that long ago. Um, yeah. This is gonna be Jeff. He's also wearing a different outfit. Hello, how's it going? Have you saved the fun the video? Uh, you can do exclamation mark cursed if you'd like to see these characters in action. <laughs> uh, but how are, you, how are you doing today? No worries. <laughs> yeah, I'll be deleting all three characters when I start my next theme. I'm not interested really in having multiple characters on my islands. I never really have been. Um, unless I need characters for something, then I'll just make them again. What are we doing? We are making uh, our three additional characters for our three additional houses coming into Lily Bell here, um, based off the Animal Crossing trailer. Um, and that's pretty much the main thing we've, we've really, really done today. There you go. Sorry about that. 
Oh, DS, that's really cool. Is it, are you... Which, uh, which Pokemon are you playing? Maybe make my download? This is nowhere near what I meant to have. I mean, that's uh, still better than what I got. <laughs> I cannot wait to move and get some better internet somewhere. I don't care where. I just, I need good internet to live, and that's, like, all I need. Oh, yeah, DS, yeah. I really, like, I need to get over and, like, get back into Pokemon Go, because there's so many of you who play it, and it looks like so much fun. Just overwhelmed. <laughs> Okay, I sure have. Still lagging, you remove so many items. Is it, do you have like a lot of designs, like design boards? Pokemon Go section is where it's at. It's fun, because like, you know, I'm... At least I was known for Animal Crossing stuff, right? I feel like that's how a lot of people find us, but then... My Discord is Pokemon Go! To live with my parents buying homes in the UK right now, such a luck-based thing. Yeah, it's very, very expensive here. Um, I pretty much can't live in the city I live in. I need to move far away to be able to afford anything. Alrighty, Jeff has arrived. <laughs> I'm housing care people are overbidding 50k easily to get the house they want. It's crazy, yeah. Um, and prices are only just going up here even more, so. Yeah, they are, Haru. They absolutely are. Um, you know, if you want a, a house or even a, a condo or an apartment in Toronto, you're paying far too much for far too little space. Um, whereas if you leave the city and move outwards, you're likely to get a lot more land, a lot more space, better housing in general for less, so. This is going to be Jeff's spot. It's the only one left. Ah, uh, Vendible. That's all good. I feel like it's a lot more normal these days to not move out. I'm 27. I'm still at home. Um, just because financially it's not feasible. Just yet. Not that I don't want to. <laughs> I think that's very common, especially if you're living in a, uh, a very expensive area. Thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. Tiny house movement is so big in Canada. Change the zone laws to allow for more tiny houses. Yes. Yeah. There we go. Oh, uh, it's a bit too close to the door. There we go. How weird is that? We finally have the four player houses eventually tomorrow Jeff or um sorry Rob I'm gonna get them confused constantly is gonna have his house and I'll work on uh Kelly and Jeff off screen here um which should be good seriously considering house sharing but just further away from me I can work from home whereas I can't so I'm seriously thinking about getting a tiny house I don't need three quarter bedroom house and right near me is five uh, Hunter of the most expensive house is 1.3 million. Oh dear. Hey, Philip, how's it going? Yeah, no, it's pricey. Um, roommates and, and being able to move in with uh, significant others, of course, helps a lot, but... Most expensive city in the West. Gyro custom design. It's really nice, isn't it? I, uh, it's one of my favorite ones. One thousand months, unless you have very decent incomes, it's very expensive, especially if you have kids, yes. Yep. It's it's crazy. It's crazy. Um, it's no wonder young people aren't able to move out as early as they want to or as early as they have in the past. So I wouldn't I wouldn't really feel bad about it. 
you know, if you're still struggling with that, it's okay. <laughs> you'll, you'll get there eventually. Um, I'm just very glad I'm able to stay at home. My parents, like, aren't sick at you, yeah. It's just easier to be single and have fur babies, yep. <laughs> Alrighty, so we have got the three new characters in, along with, obviously, Crystal. Um, and that's really good. Tomorrow, uh, Rob will have his house. I will work on Jeff and Kelly during the week, hopefully, if I remember. If not, we'll do it next week. Hey, time to smash. How's it going? Um, so I think what I want to do, uh, looking at the time, we've been live for two and a half hours. I think I'm ready to get up, go on my stretch break. If you guys want to join me, stretch yourselves out, get a drink, get a snack, treat yourself. Uh, while I'm gone, I'll play some stream moment videos for you guys, and of course some advertisements. It does help support myself and the channel without you guys actually having to do anything, which is great. Um, and when we come back, I'm thinking maybe we'll switch into some Animal Crossing GameCube, because I'm kind of feeling nostalgic today. Uh, if you've never seen Animal Crossing GameCube, my goodness, you're in for a treat. It's glorious and has aged poorly and well at the same time. The villagers are mean as heck, but I love them. Um, and I feel like it might be fun to go see if anyone new moved in. So give me about 10 minutes, give or take. Um, I'll play some moments and some ads once again. And thank you guys just so very much for being here.